Hey, Hungry Husks here with Jake and Eric, and today, game off the market. I was trying to read that! Friggin'. Uh, it said game off the market, um, and it said like 21,000 some points. Or 21,000 yeah. something. Our game is off the market because now it's not doing as hot. But we have money! Holy crap! We have 152k. I'm guessing that means 152,000. Yeah. Recent market studies suggest that the Govador G64 is steadily outselling competitors in the PC sector. Consumers prefer the lower price, greater availability, and the flexibility hardware configuration over other home computers. Experts say that this might spell the end of competing hardware manufacturers. Well, if that's the hot thing right now, let's make a game on it. Sounds like a good idea. Okay, so uh, what are we going to call this? Okay, well, what do we want to do? Uh, freaking, I don't know. Uh, medieval. Yeah, sure. Since that's the new topic that we got. Um, how about an adventure game? Like Yeah, sounds good. Like, like. Like Skyrim, but not nearly as detailed. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> it's in the 1980s. <laughs> they put <laughs> Skyrim in the 1980s. <laughs> it's just like little tech, like little pixels everywhere. <laughs> um. Okay. What are we gonna call this game? Okay. Um. Okay. Let me let me, let me type something. Okay, he's... You keep okay. you keep... the adventures. Oh, no wait. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> just Damn the it. adventures. Stupid. Oh my god. You shift. How hard is it? <laughs> the Adventures of Um, I don't know. Um oh, Jobby cool. Bobs. Jobby Bobs. <laughs> <laughs> or no wait, I, I screwed that up. <laughs> Bobby Bobs. No. Bobby Jobs. Yup. Bobby Jobs. I like Jobby Bobs too for some reason, but still. Okay. That, that should be good. Okay, yeah, the Adventures good. of Bobby Jobs. Yes. You have the freaking corn stuck underneath the keyboard. You I you have okay. I have corn mm -hmm. stuck under the keyboard? What? <laughs> cord! Oh! <laughs> Not corn! Children of the cord. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Development um, stage one. Okay. The Story. Adventures of Bobby Boom. Jobs. We gotta, we gotta make Bob Jobs, like... Bob know. Jobs. Bob Jobs. Bob Jobs. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, okay. So, yeah. We gotta make, we gotta make Bob Jobs, like, really uh, a good character. Yeah. That, that's what everyone will nickname this game. Bob Jobs. <laughs> <laughs> Bob Jobs. <laughs> Okay, dialogues. Boom. Um, artificial intelligence. Well, dirt. what does that mean exactly? That's that's AI, like computer. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Dur. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we need to get rid of those bugs. Yeah. This is the 1980s, so I know there's going to be bugs. But World still. design. Boom. Graphics. Meh. Sound. <laughs> Meh. <laughs> okay. All right, renewable venture. You gotta make Bobby Jobs. <laughs> really? Some really important guy. Dude, we have a lot of bugs. According to rumors, the Japanese company Ninvento, wow, Nin is planning to launch its very own home gaming console. Ninvento is known for the widely successful arcade game Dinky King. <laughs> They had to do a bunch of these to avoid copyright, I guess. Oh. Many industry experts doubt that home gaming consoles will take off, but we are eager to see what Nintendo looks like. Okay, whatever. Um, moving on. Okay. Oh, we got less bugs now. Oh, you oh you got rid of the bugs. Okay. You just wait. <laughs> oh. That's how you get rid of bugs. Um, okay. Yeah, we're finished. But we still have plenty of Monet. We got a new record in design, at least. Fat Guy 79. <laughs> Okay, um, the first, the first review is for our newly released game, The Adventures of Bobby Jobs came in. Please it's like catchy, it. It's catchy. So. Please like it. What? No! 
You don't understand the <laughs> importance of Bobby Jobs. Well, okay. Informed okay. Gamer Informed is Gamer is still on her good side. Game Hero likes Nice us. experience. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoyable. Okay. Oh, take that, Star Games. Star, Star Games is just like the IGN of this. I guess they're like very, uh... Like they're really they're, they're just stupid. <laughs> I was gonna say critical. They're like the though. stupid game reviewing company that like doesn't Do they actually how. exist or is... Pretty sure these are all fake. Okay. I think. Okay. So yeah, that's happening. And let's let's create game reports. We can have more research. In crap. We wait for our sales for Bobby Jobs. <laughs> Today, Ninvento has confirmed recent rumors and announced their plans to release a new home gaming console called TESS <laughs> early <laughs> next year. The console features cartridge-based games and a, and a unique design controller. If I can freaking read the text, it'd be nice. <laughs> okay. So, uh, yeah. Wait for that. Okay. Bobby Jobs. Gameplay, not so important. Naval Adventure, great combination. Okay. Uh, research. New topic. Um, well, we don't want sports. Or school. Or fashion. Um, <laughs> um airplane. I guess airplane. We'll make, like, airplane simulator. Airplane. I guess we'll make, like, airplane simulator 1982. Or, no, we'll call it... Well, okay. In real life, I'm pretty sure that exists. I'm pretty sure... And Flight sim Simulator exists, so we'll call it Pilot Simulator. Pilot Simulator. Yes. Yeah, why the hell not? Okay. Um. Alright. We already have our ideas here. Um. Simulation. Simulation. Okay. Then that, they like that, I guess. Um. Holy crap, dude. We have a lot of money. Look. Yeah. Pilot Simulator 19-something. <laughs> 1983, 19... I don't know. <laughs> 1983. I don't know. Um, yeah. The greatest game. <laughs> okay. Gameplay. Boom. Story? No. Engine? Yeah, it's pretty Yeah, because simulators don't usually have story requests. Yeah, that would be, be kind of stupid. <laughs> <laughs> you could do whatever you want in a simulation game, but you have to follow this story. Okay. Dialogue, there's like none. <laughs> <laughs> Level design can stay where it is. And artificial intelligence, boom. Artificial intelligence, boom. Artificial intelligence, boom. The heck are you talking about? Um, <laughs> well, design is surprisingly no. <laughs> really? Yeah. Um, okay. graphics, boom. Sound. Yeah. Yeah, we we want to hear the plane go. <laughs> Or or it's or since it's like okay we get the point <laughs> or it's like an eight bit okay sound. yeah we have a lot of bugs oh okay you're getting rid of them it's called wait <laughs> that's how you get rid of the bugs in this that game. that word's just... not in my vocabulary I'm I'm sorry that word is not in my vocabulary today the new game platform Tess by Ninvento has been released okay um are you gonna like generate more points okay thank you all right we got more points for technology. We need to try to create our own gaming system because we have more than enough money. That's that can only come like way later, and that's actually a lot more money than you think. Oh, really? That's like millions of dollars. Ah! Uh. <laughs> First reviews for Pilot Simulator 1983 came in. Uh or make it like the most random. Could have been. You well, could have been better. Screw you, Star Games. You could have been better. Good game. Good game. See, Star Games just hates us. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh. Oh. Oh, hey. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All oh, game. Focus focused on gameplay. Yeah. Yeah. Boom. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Okay. Get them. Make the game report. Matt. We're entrepreneurs. Yeah. Is that going to hurt? Is that going <laughs> to hurt? Get, did you get the reference? I understood that. Okay. Yeah. Hi there, I, I just, just finished, finished Pilot Simulator 1983, and I am impressed by your talent. I'm in the contracting business, and we could use skills like yours. If you are ever short on cash, just let me know, and I will see if I have some work for you. Jason. 
Contracts have now been unlocked. To see available contracts, close this message and then click anywhere on the screen to bring up the action menu. Yeah, I'm probably actually going to do contracts because that can actually give you research points. Oh, sweet. Airplane simulation is a great combination. World design does not seem to be very important in this type of game. Surprisingly. Well, actually, maybe not because most of it's sky. Um. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like you have the runway, you have the building, and then you have the sky, and that's pretty much it. <laughs> Sky's the limit. Okay. What? No, shut up. <laughs> okay. So yeah, find contract work. Okay. Contracts are a useful yeah. tool to earn some extra cash when your balance is low and you can use it. I'm screwed. Just keep on going. <laughs> I, I don't feel like reading all that. Read this. Pause Fine. it. When your balance is low and you can also, oh my god, it can also be useful Should to I generate read this? a yes. Okay. Contracts are a useful tool to earn some extra cash when your wow <laughs> cash <laughs> when your balance is low and can also be useful to generate a small number of research points. There you go. Contracts require you to generate a certain amount of design and to retain knowledge points before the time runs out. Blah, 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 blah. Decide carefully what contract you accept. If you miss the deadline for a contract, you will have to pay a penalty, so it's better to start off with smaller contracts and see how much you can handle. Okay. Uh, um, 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 um. This looks nice because we get paid and then we don't really get that much. Marco Noft. <laughs> Set up computers. Install Microsoft Boss. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Yeah. What? Wait, I forgot that there was like 17 and the time is like low. Crap. Ah. <laughs> uh. At least we got research points. We lost $5,000. Okay. Wait a second. Why did that happen? We have a certain time limit to complete it in. Uh, and you pretty much like wait for your guy to like get the points. Well, now we screw ourselves over. Well, okay. This one is five weeks and not three weeks like the other one. So we should finish this one. As long as our guy hurry, isn't hurry, Mr. Hurry, hurry, Slacker. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Hurry, 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 hurry. Come on, come on. Yeah! Go. Yes! Yeah! Yes! I we need, like, one more research point, though. Ugh. Okay, fine. I'm, I'm willing to take, like, a $12,000 loss <laughs> just to get research points. Pilot simulator. Okay. Oh, God. Technology. Give, give me the research. Technology is getting iffy. Technology is getting iffy. Go 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 Yes! Yeah! You have successfully researched custom game engine. You can now create your own game engine! <laughs> Woo! To get started, close this message and click anywhere to bring up the action menu. Okay. okay. Yes, I see. Look at that. We can do that. Except we don't have that many features, but... Alright, let me, let me do name. Do care? <laughs> I'll, I'll care. I'll name this. Um, okay. Okay, we'll name this... B -b Baloney. The baloney, um, baloney 54. <laughs> baloney 54. Okay, just random number. Okay. Okay, um, yep. 2D graphic. Just select all of them. Okay. Wait, oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Click on that. That, that, on that. that. Yeah. Baloney 54. Okay. You are now creating your own custom game engine. Once the engine is finished, you will be able to use it when creating new games. Yeah. So we just wait for this thing to do the stupid. Okay. The recent release tests. Home console by Invento has proven to be a massive success. Sales numbers have exceeded expectations by far. Uh. As one customer says, I love the games that come with the test and playing with a controller is so much more fun than a keyboard. Those stupid keyboards. Well, you know, we are making our own Baloney 54, so. Yeah. They can just shit it. Yeah, we can. It's it's a game engine. We can use it with our games. We is pimps. It's we, it's our it's our engine. We use it with with the games. This isn't our own console. We are using this for creating our own games. So is this a console gaming system or is this a computer? What the thing we just made? The Baloney Fifty Four. That it's a game engine. I don't know what that is. You. It's what people program in. Oh. 
Basically, it allows for games to have better features and therefore be better. Oh. That is what... That's the whole purpose of that. So, we can create one more game, I guess. Okay, yeah. Okay. One more game. Because we have an engine and, yeah, baloney 54. Um... It's... How about, how about aliens? Aliens. Go all sci-fi and crap. And have some action. And a, a test. Yes, I don't care. Wait, what? Did we just lose $80,000? That's licensing costs. Uh, damn it, Eric. I didn't want you to do that. Well, we still have money. Okay, fine. You have to take risks. Okay. All right. Forget I don't know. Okay. I don't know. Um, type in a thing. Let me think. Uh, we will call this the 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 invading. That's it. Yeah, pretty much. Nothing. Nothing better. Does it really matter? Yes, it does actually. Okay, should we use this? Yes. Okay, start filming. Oh, oh God! <laughs> We're down by a lot. We have to we have to take some financial risks sometimes. Um. Okay. Engine. Boom. Gameplay. Meh. Story is like non-existent. It's just shoot the aliens. Okay. <laughs> just shoot the aliens. We'll be revolution. No, no. Don't have a story in a game that's not focused on story. Don't be <laughs> stupid. <laughs> the invading. The invading. Um. Are you gonna like actually like? Start something. Okay, there we go. <laughs> yeah, games. We have a lot of bugs. We need to fix that. <laughs> Crap ton of bugs. Okay. Um. Yeah. This is all good. <laughs> Recent studies suggest that the increased variety in games, gaming devices, also creates a market for more specialized games. Some platforms become more popular with younger gamers, while other cater to the more mature audience groups. As more and more developers enter the market, we expect developers to focus their games on specific age groups to really make an impact. New research available! Target audience! Basically, this is when they started to do, like, rated E for everyone and crap. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, okay. So, and this is all good, too. <laughs> really? You don't want better world design? You're in, you're, it's like a 2D space shooting game. Oh, well, okay, never mind then. The, it's just a background oh, wow. of we dots. we have 468 fans, I just realized that. Yeah, dang. Following the massive success of the test console, there are now rumors circulated that Vina, another Japanese company, is planning to release a home gaming console of their own. I'm guessing that's a parody of Sega. Vina! I don't know. Well, it does go along with the jingle. Yeah. It would look really weird as a logo, though. It would. Okay. Um, we have a lot of technology points. Jeez. <laughs> okay. Finish. Finish is cramp. All right. The invading. Sixteen. New record. Uh, yeah. Everything like leveled up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Except for story. Okay. Let's. Oh, we got new research. Oh no, Sam. New research. All right. We'll see this. Cool. The game reviews of the invading. Um, uh, it's freaking no. stars always gives us a six. Oh, oh no! Informed gamer hates us now too. Dang. Oh, oh! I think it's trying to tell us something. <laughs> At least yes! all games still all likes games. us. At least all games still likes us. I think the best rating we got was an eight or something. Today, Vina has confirmed recent rumors about a new gaming console announced, the Master V. Oh, for God's sakes. <laughs> should, have it, claims... should have called it the Master D. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> the company it's claims that the Master, the Master V successful is test test I was reading! <laughs> is technically superior to the massively successful tests by Nivento. Plans to release it in the coming months. Okay. That is blah. Okay. I'll just generate this report, and I will do that. It'll be good. I'll get some research points. It'll be all fun and good and dandy. And I think we are going to end it right here. Yes. This has been Hungry Husks with Jake and Eric. And this oh. has been Game Dev. Okay. Wait, what's this? Okay, well, okay, there's this. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, you can read and that. This is, <laughs> this is Game Dev Tycoon. We're signing off. We are done. We are done.
done. We are done.